Let's proceed to diagnosis according to Zanko organ patterns with a pattern urinary bladder damp heat. Urinary bladder damp heat is typically an acute disorder. It can often develop into a chronic condition with acute episodes. Many women find that they suffer from recurrent urinary tract infections and that these infections increase in frequency. These infections are often treated with Western medication. Unfortunately, these pharmaceutical products often have a double negative effect. The Western medications clears the heat aspect of the disorder, but does not address the damp aspect. This means that there will remain a lingering damp pathogen, which will start to generate heat, resulting in symptoms of a new, new infection. Furthermore, due to its cold nature, the Western medicine weakens kidney and spleen yang, resulting in additional dampness that seeps down to the lower jaw, laying the foundation for a new damp heat condition in the urinary bladder. This is again treated with cold medication that does not drain the pathogenic chi completely out of the urinary bladder, but increases dampness in the vicious cycle is started. Damp heat, as stated earlier, often arises when damp cold transforms into damp heat. This transformation will accelerate if there is already heat present in the body. An excessive consumption of food and beverages that are energetically hot, stress, and cheese stagnation heat are typically contributing factors. Now let's look into its etiology. Invasions of exogenous damp, cold, and heat, dietary factors that produce dampness and damp heat, as well as repeated use of medicines that are energetically cold. Stress, emotional frustrations, pent-up anger, hatred, jealousy, and irritation can cause liver cheese stagnation, heat, or heart fire, which can drain down to the urinary bladder. The symptoms and signs are as follows. Burning, stinging sensation during urination, frequent urgent but scant urination, difficult, difficulty urinating or in fully voiding the urinary bladder, dark, yellowish, turbid, and odorous urine, possibly blood in the urine, tightness and distension above the pubic bone, thirst with no desire to drink, a fever, fever or feeling of heat in the body, yellowish, greasy coating on the root of the tongue, raised red papillae on the root of the tongue, rapid and wiry or rapid and slippery pulse and the sure position may be full. The key symptoms here are burning sensation upon urination, urgent but scanty urination, dark and cloudy urine, greasy yellow coating on the root of the tongue. For the treatment principle, we drain damp heat from the urinary bladder. And for the acupuncture points, we can choose from REN2, REN3, SPLEEN6, SPLEEN9, LI11, bladder 22, bladder 28, and bladder 32, and use the draining needle technique. For the explanation on the choice of points, REN2, REN3, bladder 28, bladder 32, drain damp and heat from the urinary bladder. SPLEEN6, SPLEEN9, bladder 22, and LI11, drain damp heat. Mm -hmm. As a relevant advice, when there is urinary bladder damp heat, the person should avoid foods and beverages that generate damp or heat. They should avoid exposure to climatic influences that can result in damp, heat, or cold invading the body. They should also avoid stress and situations that can result in emotional frustrations. Urinary bladder damp heat can be caused by the following patterns of imbalance. Damp cold, damp, liver chi stagnation, liver chi stagnation and urinary bladder chi stagnation, heart fire, kidney yang deficiency, and spleen chi deficiency. In turn, it can result to kidney yin deficiency, phlegm, urinary bladder, blood stagnation, and chi stagnation. So to summarize, damp heat in the bladder has its etiology and excessive exposure to exterior damp heat or dampness or cold emotional strain. Its underlying or accompanying pathology are dampness and heat in the bladder. Possible presenting conditions, urinary, tra urinary tract infections or urinary calculus. 
Signs and symptoms, frequent and urgent urination, burning urination, difficult urination, dark yellow turbid urine, blood in the urine, fever, thirst with desire to drink, hypogastric fullness and pain, feeling hot and sand and stones in the urine. The pulse is slippery, rapid and wiry on the left rear position. The tongue is thick with sticky yellow coating on the root with red spots. The treatment principle, we clear heat and disinhibit damp in bladder, free waterways, disinhibit water and free lint. For the acupuncture treatment, screen 9 to for damp heat in the lower burner, bladder 22 to open the lower water passages, stomach 28 to regulate the bladder and urination, bladder 28 for dampness in the bladder, screen 6 for damp heat in the lower burner, REN 3 the front we point of the bladder, REN 9 to resolve general dampness. With middle with drainage for small amounts of red urine, we use uh, do 27. For pain on urination, you can use liver 5 and liver 2. For blood in urine, you can use spleen 10 and bladder 16. Thank you for your attention.